This is a uh, Husqvarna tiller and it's powered by a Briggs & Stratton 900 series engine and uh, in this video I'm going to show you what the carburetor linkages uh, look like for this engine. I removed the uh, gas tank and air filter housing so you can get a better view of the carburetor linkages and um, the way that the linkages are configured is how the factory set up this engine uh, for this particular piece of equipment. They've never been uh, changed uh, this is my carburetor, uh, my choke, my throttle, uh, my governor arm, and then I've got this arm here where my uh, throttle cable connects to, and the hole, I removed the throttle cable, but the hole for the, the cable is right here. The uh, carburetor linkages for this engine are made up of a uh, solid steel uh, rod, uh, your throttle cable, and three springs. Uh, two of the springs are not adjustable. Now I'm going to show you the uh, connection points for the carburetor linkages. Uh, I'm going to start with the throttle on the carburetor and you have two things. Uh, you have the solid steel rod that connects to the rubber grommet on the throttle and then for the other hole you have the spring which is not adjustable. Uh, just fits into that hole there and if you follow this back you'll see that it connects to the governor arm and then you have the same thing. You have the rubber grommet for the solid steel rod and then the other hole is for the other end of the spring. The uh, next connection point is for the other uh, non-adjustable spring which is right here and it connects to the body of this mechanism right here and the other end connects to the hole on the uh, governor arm. The next connection point is for the spring which is adjustable which is right here. Uh, it connects on one end to the arm which is controlled by the throttle cable. I'll zoom in here so you can see it. Uh, the spring kind of looks like a paper clip. And if you go to the other end it connects to the uh, governor arm. And for this piece of equipment Husqvarna chose to use the number three hull. Um, which, which hull you choose to use will change the uh, top uh, govern engine speed and if you find this engine on another piece of equipment the manufacturer may choose to use another hull but uh, for this tiller they've, they've chosen the number three hull. And then the uh, last connection point is where the throttle cable connects to this arm right here which I've um, gone, gone ahead and reinserted the cable so you can see it. And then the cable is fastened to another piece that um, I've taken off so I could get the gas tank off but basically that's all there is to the the carburetor linkages for this engine. Uh, again this is a Briggs & Stratton 900 series uh, engine and it is used on a Husqvarna tiller. So you can get a better view here. And I uh, hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.